Unquestionably, Elon Musk is one of the most influential CEOs in the world. Despite all his remarkable accomplishments and successes, he still encounters tremendous obstacles on Twitter. Some admire him, while others are outright terrified by his presence. For instance, the prominent politician Elizabeth Warren has been at odds with Musk for a long time over her belief that he should pay billions in taxes. Senator Warren has identified several concerns she has about Tesla and expressed her worries about them. Warren recently demanded an explanation from the Tesla board regarding their position on Musk's potential conflicts of interest, misuse of company assets, and other actions that could harm Tesla and its shareholders. Also, Senator Warren has brought up the question of whether Elon Musk was tunneling resources from his own private company, Twitter, to Tesla, a publicly traded company. She emphasized that doing so would go against legal boundaries to be loyal to Twitter and might be in violation of anti-tunneling laws. Musk, in response, revealed the reason why Elizabeth Warren's position as a senator for the USA is harmful for the nation. Furthermore, Senator Warren has accused Elon Musk of avoiding paying federal income taxes. This is a very interesting situation, so let's explain it. Senator Elizabeth Warren has raised significant worries about possible clashes of interest and illegal activity for Tesla subsequent to Elon Musk's acquisition of Twitter. In a letter addressed to Tesla chair Robin Denholm, Massachusetts Democrat Eddie Markey raised the concern that Tesla shareholders may be adversely affected by CEO Elon Musk's ownership of the electric car company. He additionally inquired as to whether or not the board is taking sufficient measures to address this issue. Warren recently asked the Tesla board to explain their stance on conflicts of interest, misappropriation of corporate holdings, and other activities by Musk that could be detrimental to Tesla and its shareholders. When approached for comment on the letter, Tesla did not give an instant response. This issue was already reported on previously by the New York Times. Following Elon Musk's April disclosure that he had purchased a hefty stake in Twitter, Tesla stocks have nosedived 58%, erasing nearly $800 billion of market capitalization. Mr. Musk's acquisition created unavoidable conflicts of interest, Warren wrote in the letter dated Sunday. Warren, who had disagreements with Musk in the past, specifically emphasized that Twitter's ad revenue comes from General Motors. Ford and Chevrolet, all of which are direct competitors of Tesla. In a statement, Warren warned that as the owner of Twitter, Musk could very well choose to run the company in ways that prioritize profit over everything else, even if it means providing disadvantages for Tesla's rivals and diminishing their own position in the market. Warren also added that as a part of his responsibility for Tesla, Musk may use Twitter to promote the company's products. He could covertly revise algorithms so that positive comments about Tesla will gain more attention while negative remarks will be censored. Warren was particularly concerned that Musk's alleged transfer of Tesla software engineers and other staff to Twitter may have violated securities or other laws. When asked if her social media accounts had been verified, Warren simply said she has no interest in it. But regardless, both of her accounts were already officially certified. Senator Warren raised the issue of whether Elon Musk was tunneling resources from Tesla, a publicly traded company, to his own private business, Twitter. She highlighted that this would violate Musk's legal obligation to be loyal to Twitter and could breach the anti-tunneling regulations created to prevent insiders from misappropriating resources from their companies. Additionally, Musk took to Twitter and posted in response to a remark about the senator's letter humorously noting that the United States has undeniably experienced harm from her being elected as a senator. This year has seen the stock of the EV company take a nosedive, dropping more than 50%. However, when Musk asked in the poll about his possible resignation as CEO of Twitter, shares began to inch slightly upwards. According to Musk, Tesla has revolutionized the automobile industry by introducing electric cars for the very first time. This is an accomplishment that no other company had achieved prior. Yet, in order to ensure a sustainable energy future, he emphasized that they cannot do it alone and must rely on all car companies working together to make progress. Musk confidently defended Tesla's stock price, emphasizing the long-term value proposition of self-driving vehicles as a major attraction for investors. He declared that autonomy is the biggest factor in value. With the average car being used only 1.5 hours a day or 12 hours per week, experts suggest that autonomous vehicles could be utilized five times more up to 50 plus hours in one single 168 hour week. This concept is particularly exciting for those looking forward to futuristic car sharing economies and has been proposed as an innovative solution by experts. Speaking to the audience later, Musk admitted that he rarely succeeds in convincing people to invest in his Tesla Motors enterprise.
However, he pointed out a key benefit of self-driving cars with self-driving. The car becomes five times more useful, but costs the same amount to build. Furthermore, for years, Warren has harshly criticized Twitter's CEO, and the two have been engaged in a public feud since. After she called out his lack of federal income tax payment for 2018, he mockingly referred to her as Senator Karen. In April, Warren voiced a disapproval of Musk's agreement to buy Twitter in a tweet, calling it disastrous for our democracy. Neither Warren's nor Musk's representatives gave a response to inquiries sent outside of their usual business hours. Also, Musk responded to a tweet from Farzad Masba, former Tesla program manager and now content creator as mentioned on his LinkedIn profile. The post in question was about the letter that Warren sent to the chairperson of Tesla's board, who is Musk himself being its majority shareholder, questioning whether shareholders were financially affected by Musk taking time off working for Twitter. Elizabeth Warren is the last person I would ever want anywhere close to Tesla, Masba posted. Tesla CEO Elon Musk, an infamous Twitter personality with a colossal 84 million followers, has criticized the platform often due to its views on free speech and censorship. He did not respond directly to Senator Warren's tweets. However, he tweeted earlier that day that he hopes those who disagree with him still use the site. I hope that even my worst critics remain on Twitter because that is what free speech means, Musk wrote. Moreover, the battle between progressive Senator Warren and tech billionaire Musk has been an ongoing one as the former advocates for tougher taxation on top earners. The feud has taken place both online and in the public domain, with tweets from either party being at the center of it all. In December, Senator Warren used her Twitter platform to challenge Elon Musk's avoidance of federal income taxes. This criticism followed his recent recognition as Time Magazine's Person of the Year. Incredibly, ProPublica reported that in 2018 and 2017 respectively, Musk had paid $65,000 and $68,000 in taxes, an amount minuscule compared to his wealth. Evidently, he skirts through the tax system with ease while millions are struggling under its burden day by day. Let's change the rigged tax code so the person of the year will actually pay taxes and stop freeloading off everyone else, Warren posted. The following day, Musk took to Twitter with the response that read, Stop projecting, and included a link to an article on Fox News concerning Warren's previous claims of having Native American ancestry. His second tweet further clarified the point by stating that Warren reminded him, of when I was a kid and my friend's angry mum would just randomly yell at everyone for no reason. That's it. Subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell.